Assalamualaikum In this video, I will explain to you Poison property distribution The example This is gonna be the basic example Where you have to solve using the formula Let's look at the example The number of complaints received by a city council in a week Has a poison distribution with mean 7 The question asks you to find the probability That in a week, there will be Part A, no complaints. Part B, three complaints received. Part C, at most two complaints received. Now, let's look at the part A first. Now, first and foremost, when you have this kind of question, you have to write down your random variable x. So, over here, your random variable x would be number of complaints received in a week. Now, then determine your parameter with the notation of your distribution. So, x here has a Poisson distribution because it's mentioned already in the question. Poisson distribution with a mean 7. Now, this is going to be your lambda. So, lambda here is 7. Lambda 7 is 7 complaints. Receive in a week. Okay. Now, part A question asks you, find the probability in a week there will be no complaint received. Probability, no complaint Is equivalent to PX equivalent to zero. So you're gonna have using the formula such that if PX equivalent to R equivalent to P e minus lambda lambda power R over by R factorial. So from the question, you know what is your lambda and you know what is your R. So, substitute into the formula, you're going to get E minus 7, 7 power 0 over by 0 factorial. What you have to do is just substitute into your calculator and calculate. You're going to get your answer as such as 0 0.0009. Alright, now let's continue into part B and part C. So, if the question asks you, three complaints received, so what you're going to have is that. So, part B, for three complaints received, is simply Px equivalent to 3. Again, it's just an equivalent, so just substitute into the formula, such that your lambda, lambda is still 7, but your R now is 3. And you're going to get... E minus 7 lambda, lambda 7 power 3 over by 3 factorial. Again, use your calculator. You're going to get your answer. 0 0.0521. So, that is going to be your probability when 3 complaints received in a week. Now, let's look at part C. Now, part C asks the question of at most 2 complaint received. When P at most 2 complaints, this is just you're going to change into the notation such most going to have X will be less and equivalent to 2. You know before that when you have at most, you're going to have to sum up from P X equivalent to 0 plus by P X equivalent to 1 plus by Px equivalent to 2. Again, you substitute into the formula each term. So, you're going to have E minus 7, 7 power 0 over by 0 factorial plus by E minus 7, 7 power 1 over by 1 factorial plus by E minus 7, 7 power 2 over by 2 factorial. Now, you can actually simplify the term because there is basic common term which is E minus 7 
So the first one, 7 power 0 is going to give you 1. And 0 factorial also give you 1. So 1 over 1 would give you 1. Plus by 7 power 1 is 7. Over by 1 factorial is 1. You're going to get 7. Plus by 7 power 2 is 49. Over by 2 factorial, basically 2 multiplied by 1, which is equivalent to 2. So then from here, it is already a simplified form. Calculate, you're going to get 0 0.0296. Okay.